Hello and welcome. How are you doing, my friend? And next I am planning to show you that how to test and check camshaft bearing status. And what is first this camshaft bearing status? Okay, here I have camshafts. It looks like that. And this camshaft position is in here. And we have in here that area. One, two, three, four. Four, five, these camshaft bearings areas, and this area is like there's two part. This inner area in here, that area, that, 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 and I have clean cotton cloth that I can clean these. And these areas in here, they are specific metal in that area, aluminium specific. It is not standard aluminium. But it's, it is just perfect aluminium uh, mixture in here. And this is like this bearing area, and it takes contact in this camshaft, this bearing contact points in here. And this is like another part in this area. And they take contact, and there is only two lubrications. First is oil. And second is this metallic material and mixture, because this is just specific metal in here. And this metal is different in here than in here. This is like just professional coating and small area. There is this bearing, camshaft bearing material in here. And then we have, of course, and we look at that, that another, another camshaft. In here, I moved that in that position. And when we look at another, this is like in, intake camshaft, and that was, was exhaust camshaft. And then the, we have in here this another part, because this is like inner part of this camshaft bearing, and this is like outer part. And I take this specific bolts away, and when I clean that area in that way, this is like this another part in this camshaft bearing. And again, this inner area, there is a specific small uh, tin uh, this, uh, layer and plate of this uh, camshaft bearing in that area, what I, now, what I touch now. And it is really, really, really thin amount, about 0 point, uh, 0 0.1 millimeter. Okay, and then when we are planning to check that what is our camshaft bearing status, we need to check three areas. One, two, three. And first area is that area, and then second area is this camshaft area, this area in here. And third one is then this outer and top area in here. And how to do that check? The check is made so that we look, like in here, we look that this is really big camshaft area. We need to use very soft cotton cloth and we clean that, that bearing area totally. And we look that very carefully, that can we see any scratches or bad, bad blue or black dents in here. And this, this bearing looks really good because there is no any scratches in here and there is also no any blue or black uh, markings in here. That is good. And then we check next, next one. This looks also good and in soft material. When I look, I can see there very small dent. Look here. In that area, there is small dent. This area, and, but then when I touch that, I think that it is so so small that it is not bad in here. And then I check that bearing contact point. This looks also good. And then this next one, and then there is this final. It looks also good. Okay. Excellent. That means that this lower area is okay. Then, then I need to check 
this my cam shaft, this this area, and I clean that area. Now I am also again searching some scratches or bad dents or something else, and this area looks also good. And how bad dent is next one? Next one. There I can see small dents. This should be totally clean all areas. There is a little bit worn out. And if we can see really big dents, what we can what we can feel in our finger or see that there is a hole, then we need to replace this camshaft. And now I believe that this my camshaft is quite okay. There is by the way this oil hole. Oil goes through that hole in this this camshaft bearing area, and I think that this my camshaft this is, is quite okay. And then I inspect this this uh, upper areas top bearing points, and there we have also situation that I check that what is this uh, color look. It it looks. It must be look like silver, and this looks quite okay, and there is no any scratches. And then next one, it is a little bit dirty, but I cleaned that. And in here, I can see small, small dents and those burnouts in there. Okay, and here I have this is a little bit burnout, and. Then next one, what is this status? And in here I can see also a little bit some small small dent in here. And now I take my glove away because this our finger is best. That can I see anything? No, it is very clean, and that means that this bearing is also okay. And then I had this final one. Let's look at what is this status. And in here, here we have some small issues. There is there is some dents in here, and that means that that in that bearing point. This has been damaged a little bit. There are those scratches, but sometimes we can see even bigger and that's I think that this area is almost bad because there are those scratches, but I believe that because most of these others are okay. This is not the this react and sunsel sunselation result because only one is bad and others are quite good. Okay, but if you have all those bearings in that status, then I recommend that we purchase new these bearing caps and also this um, we might to be need to replace also the cylinder head and also this cam shaft for new one. Okay and that kind of information today to you and see you in next movie.